Don't do that. What's up? I'm here with the boys. The film festival stuff is gonna be awesome. Well, here we are in the video camera. Ezra Monroe, famous. Hello. Hello. Yes, bro. What's up, Dad? About all that shit we do, I won't tell. Have the camera. Thanks. Jack, uh, Jack Bowman, you Light Ray. Yes, Bowman. <laughs> The kickoff for the E48. You're scaring us, <laughs> silly boy. I told him he was scaring us. God. Oh my God. does it stand for? What does it mean? What does it mean? What does it mean?
My name is Eli Gray, and today I'm going to be investigating a local school. Um, people know that schools and buildings like it, they are widely known for being haunted, haunted in some sense. The schools most of the time are not going to actually be haunted. I mean, unless you've got some gruesome murder or demonic creatures moving about, nothing's actually going to happen. Schools, due to how many people go through it on a daily basis, as well as the emotions felt in the building, from a stressful test coming up or that high school sweetheart breakup, it's seeped in it. You can hear the footsteps of people walking in empty hallways, or the voices of people in classrooms with nobody in them. But that doesn't necessarily mean that there are ghosts. In reality, it's just empty hallways with no one in them. Yo, Azazel, you got any twos? Go fish. Here we have the being that calls itself Azazel. They are actually an old Victorian person that was thought to be a witch and therefore burned at the stake, but they've chosen the name Azazel, which is interesting to me as the demon Azazel is commonly used as the scapegoat being, and a lot of witch trial victims were just that, scapegoats. They are the second oldest of the bunch, and reasonably See, very upset with I'm just about there, everything. Like they are impatient and slightly Guy, uncooperative. You wanna ask me? I know you wanna ask me. Here we have Cameo, a early 2000s frat boy who seems to have partied a little too hard in their previous life. And that seemed to be the end of them. They are rather casual and ob obnoxiously outgoing, actually. Fortissima. Yeah. Wait, did you Here we have Fortissima, a young musician who rose to fame and fell hard, inevitably ending their own life. They are deeply uncomfortable in the body they are currently in, due to the short hair, so they've raided the theater closet for a red and black wig to really get that musician feel, and they have had to get used to using a cane due to the body's disability. They're a casual person, but due to their being accustomed to the hustle and bustle of the life of a musician, they are easily bored, perceivably. Do you have seven? <laughs> no. Esme, a homecoming queen whose life was cut short during the middle of the hippie height of the 1970s, was run over while biking home from homecoming. She Yo, was clearly well. once a spiritualist, making it really check out that she's the only one that didn't choose a demonic name for themselves. They're rather social, if a bit forward. Yo, Azazel, you got any twos? Go fish. Easy, bub. <laughs> you got nines. Here we have Beelzebub. Uh, <laughs> well, here we would have Beelzebub? <laughs> I, I don't know. I couldn't get any coherent words out of them or anything about it, which probably really checks out for the title they've chosen of Beelzebub. Um, they seem to be a very, very old spirit, if a spirit at all. Probably the most likely to actually be a demonic being here. I found this footage on the camera that corporate provided for us on an SD card that was supposed to be blank. As you can see, somebody came into the school and decided to do some business with spell work and sigil magic. Hello. <clears throat> oh great, this is this should be fun. Eventually, she's gotta get back to her life. I don't think so. Alright, alright, get out, get out! Hello. Hi. Missed you. Missed you. I'm bored. I'm bored too. 
The humans are not as fun as I thought they would be. Speaking of humans and fun, they're playing a football game. They're gonna go beat each other up if you wanna watch. I love to flick the lights flicker. I think it's so funny. I know. Um, so what do you expect to gain from the experience of being here in this whole circumstance? Do you know how bored being dead is? Oh, we need something entertaining to do. I understand. Boredom. All right, all right. Speaking of entertaining, Grandpa, we got a game to go to. I, I'm in the middle of something. Please. You better put on. Me. I've got stuff I'm trying to do. Well, E-paranormal productions go out there, go to a location and do whatever Wait, what you want. Wait, what was that? E-paranormal productions? What's the E mean? Uh... What does the E mean? They just told us it's our cover. Man, that's just... Cover? Cover. Yeah, like title. Cover? So bored! Don't you think we should move on? We didn't get to watch Murphy and me. I mean, we already got caught. What if they tell other people? We can move on. I mean, there's other people to pass. But Murphy and me. We can always find somewhere else. Y'all ready? Okay. Is it? Where did I get a guitar from? Hold up. School's infested! I gotta get out of here! Man. Whatever. This is last year's Harrison. I should be in, out of here anyway. We're all safe, we're cockroaches. Nasty school. And board game that we didn't even play. Gross. <sighs> Cockroach didn't do anything though. Alright. Man, can't wait to get out of this freaking school. Wait, hold on. Why are these lights always flickering? <gasps> um, I'ma chalk that up to tiredness. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, man, nah, I'm tripping. <sighs> One last thing, then I can only get out of this freaking school. Or what I more reasonably would like to call it. A hat. Wait, something moved. Ah. Uh, Hey, Mel. Nah, gotta go. Keys. Kicks are preserved, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but no, okay. For real. 
I ain't never going back to that school after dark. Never. Not after school, no nothing. My grades can fail, I don't care. Honestly. I'd rather eat at Arby's. I, I'd just rather eat at Arby's. Where, where am I? Money, 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 money. Children's stores? Money. Whoa, whoa, okay. Who, who are you? Who are you? E? What is, what does E mean? Okay. Cheese? Um, cheese? What, what does that mean? Why are you giving me cheese note? Don't you mean cheese? Elijah. Baba, Ami Tumaki Kisu Borta Chai. Kihuese Putro. Ami Bia Korbo. Bia Kake Bia Korba. Angela! Na, Shai Tomar Jogona. Kinto Ami Take Volvo Shai. To me, Tomar Manchoman not the Corso. To me, Amar de Pambali Manchoman no the Korba. To me, Amar de Kukure. Shoman no se corva. Doki toki da. Na! Chup! Eh, ki 
said, eh, yeah. Electric Red. Lisa Mean Way. Oh, oh. No. Those no, are not my Okay. Super guy, pa man. Love you, okay, okay, good. Moi, je Mais tu moi, la pépé. Petit fille, on gagne bénédiction, moi. Merci, maman. Gracias por venir. Antes que empezamos, hay alguien que se pone a este matrimonio. No soporto este matrimonio. Cállese. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the tenacious bloodbath. This guy's is but a simple card game. Called you know. This is so dumb. It's not that serious. Last time I won easily with my superior intellect. With all my preparation, I'll have no problem destroying them this time. Should be a piece of cake. I don't know how to play this game. What does E mean? What the heck? The card's not even in the game! Oh my god, he knows everything! Scooter! You ruined everything! I'm done! I'm done! I'm done! Nope! I can't believe you mad it this far. You can't even- you can't- what is happening? My death was on the line. You expect me to play this game correctly? Expect. Why can't I say expect? Well, I'm done. But we can't talk. It's Fiend. I'm so glad you could make it to this job interview, Ellen. I am as wool. Oh, what did you say your name was again? Um. Mm. Okay, um. Mm.
Hi, I was wondering if you want to go on a date with me. Hey, no. I can't do this anymore! Let's finish this! Dang it! Wait, let me check my pockets. <laughs>